A new man passing by. Life is good, best I've ever felt. So we are giving up on Costco because it is insanely crowded. Like to the point that people are starting to park over in a completely different parking lot. It's odd. I don't. And we just need exactly butter why. and we want to roam. Yeah, I just feel like we need a lot. So we're gonna go to uh, uh, what is it? Goodwill, drop some stuff off. And yeah, that guy gave up too. Yeah. Um. So anyways. Well, plus it's only been an open an hour, so not. I think a lot of people are in and they haven't come out yet. Yeah. Well, it's like, it takes like a half hour to do Costco. Depends. Some people are slow. I just don't understand why it's so busy. Yeah, I mean, I, I would have last week would have been crazy, and then it was. It was busy, but not like this. I don't know. So we're giving up. Like loaded. We come all the way to this side of the parking lot, I guess. Yeah, I guess we could. Yeah. I don't like this side of the parking lot because it's. I don't know why. It's not our side of the parking lot. No, it's more dangerous. Like, the chances that aisles are smaller and your chances of getting hit by someone and backed into by a grandma is like super high. Yeah, all right. Well, I'm just saying. You asked me why, and that's no, why. No, I know. I said all right. <laughs> okay, we actually came to Goodwill. Well, it's called Value Village, it's our version of Goodwill. Um, actually dropping off my stuff it's been a couple days I didn't I was so tired you guys yesterday I was so tired I couldn't even function um, so I was gonna go back out if Ashley had wanted to go for a play date but she fell asleep so just quick update on the kids everyone is healthy again Abby and Kaylee work tonight Abby's feeling much better yes. um, went to school this morning went to school yesterday I think I called her out the other days but it was like 20 minute classes because they have like state testing or something like that that she didn't need to do so she didn't miss much school at all um, even though I had to call her out for it but um, so everyone's feeling better which is great I think that's why I took a nap yesterday because I was worried that if I kept going just super tired that I would wear myself down to the point where I could catch whatever they have had and so I didn't want to do that um, also, I also need to get my prescription. I, mm. I put a prescription in at Costco, so I do actually need to go. We just gotta find a parking space. Yeah, we'll try again in just a second here. So, um, anyway, so everyone is doing pretty good. We're gonna go into a pretty chill weekend. We do have a party this weekend for Ashley's cheer squad, and uh, that should be really, really fun. Uh, to kind of reconnect. It was fun at that little uh, family friends night to reconnect with all the people that we went to Japan with. And all of us are really looking forward to um, uh, getting together and actually being able to talk. So that'll be really fun. Okay, we pulled in to Costco. And look what happens. Another fellow Tesla driver <laughs> is pulling out. Yes, we're at the very end of the parking lot. But that's okay. It was meant to be. Get our steps in. Yes. Get yes. I am planning on going on a walk. Um, as soon as we're done with this. I am going to take advantage of the blue skies. I have a good have book. And probably two or three podcasts I could listen to. Um, get away from him. <laughs> as much as I... I literally thought today was going to... Like yesterday I thought it was Wednesday. I had it in my head and I was like, oh, I just had to like, cause I didn't in my head have anything on Thursday, even though it was Thursday. So I'm like, what am I gonna do all day on a rainy day? And cause I, on the, on the weather map, Thursday was supposed to be cloudy and overcast, which it was overcast. And so when I realized at like what, 11 o'clock last night that you were, that it was Friday today and you were off work and this lady, you need to go. happy. She's going. Is she? She's got her bags out. She's putting stuff in. Be patient. I know. It seems like she's organizing them a whole lot more than she needs to for this busy day at Costco. You're not even going to get a Costco haul because we're literally just going for butter. But everyone can't know. make. It seems like there's something else we need. They can't make toast and mac and cheese. And so they're getting really irritated with us. The kids. Or cookies. Or cookies. Abby could make cookies this weekend. Can't make anything without butter. So, we do need butter and it's the cheapest price. She needs help with that. And hopefully by the time we get the butter and find this parking spot, my prescription is ready to be filled because I'm out of the medicine I need. Yes, and I really, like if it's busy today, 
I am not coming here tomorrow on a Saturday. Are you kidding me? No. So, oh, the woes of Costco. Yeah, first world problems. Mm hmm. We did just get butter, but we also realized we had no eggs and bread. And then we found a new snack for game night tonight. Tomorrow night? Tomorrow night. All right. Did five miles. I feel really good about that. You're in a different angle. I'm trying a different angle without showing my gut. <laughs> Down below. Um, I feel good about it. It's hot. It's not even 70 degrees out there, but when you're in the sun the whole time. It feels really hot. So, I think Jason went to help his dad with something that probably involved the ladder, and given that the fact that he fell off the ladder and started to go unconscious for who knows how long, we've all warned him not to do that alone anymore. So Jason's doing something with the attic and a ladder at his dad's house. And I think he said he wanted to go on a, a walk, like a power walk, like uphill power walk somewhere. But I don't know if he's gone to do that yet. So Chelsea's due home from school soon. She had her major final um, science project presentation today so I'm curious to see how that went I haven't texted her during the school day just because I don't want to make her nervous but one of her really good friends got to go before her she's like I think I'll just I'll feel better if she goes before me and uh, shows me that you know not much to worry about so curious to see how she did she wore one of Kaylee's old dresses and uh, changed into that right before the presentation and then we'll change out of it back into her normal teenage attire to come home. So I told her um, to ask the teacher if she could have her friend record it for her. She's like, no, number one, we had to put our phones away in our backpack. We can't have them out. And two, she said that would be awkward. <laughs> so she won't let me. Um, I mean, she'll be able to tell me if it went well, but... I won't be able to actually see it, unfortunately. All right, I'm gonna sit here and drink the rest of this water before I drive home because I'm starting to feel my hands get swollen and dehydrated. So I'm gonna hydrate and then go home. I think I'm gonna make an, an artichoke for lunch and uh, some carrots while I wait for that to cook. And uh, This, hey, one, one sec. this one decided to get off the couch and go I know, for a I'm walk. I'm so tired. I've already lapped you. <laughs> yes. Done my five miles, taking a shower, taking kid to play date, had lunch. Yeah, and so, I'm gonna go for a walk. All right. Um, I'm on the phone with Nate, but anyways, okay, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna go down the hill and then up and do my little upper route and back. Okay. All right. All right. Have all a good right, time. So I'll see you soon. All right. Maybe instead of Din Tai Fung, we go to Panda Express. You're really going to compare the two. <laughs> That's not even funny. That's not even funny. I really want Din Tai Fung. And they moved to a new location, so there's no, no wait. There's no wait, even on a Friday night. <laughs> My friends went, and they went on a Saturday night. And they just walked right in. <laughs> so good. Garlic green beans. Shaolong Bao. I think that's how you say it. I gotta convince him to take me. I'm really full right now. So I can't eat right now. Luckily he's still going for his walk. Um, artichokes really fill you up. I had an artichoke, carrots, half a cucumber. Not half. Little, you know, like a, a good little chunk of cucumber. So I'm pretty full. I don't think I could eat for another couple hours. So I, I'm going to work on him. I'm going to work on him a little bit longer. See if, but I got to go home and edit regardless. So I've got to get some work done on the computer. We just picked Ashley up. She's been at her friends for a couple hours. And as I knew what happened, we ended up talking to her friend's mom and one of the neighbors 
who they all are, we're all starting to realize that we have familiar friends and uh, started talking. And I'm glad we did not get our ice cream before we came to pick you up. I, oh, your shoes. Like, do you want to put tie your shoes? Oh. Please, Ashley, those are Abby's shoes. I let her. Yeah, she matter. had them out because doesn't she does wear them. We have to take care of we our stuff. We will go and get her some new shoes for the summer. Um, but I'm having. I'm just crossing over here. She's tired. But I'm glad I didn't get the ice cream before we went to get her because it would be melted by now. So, and then I think we're gonna call it a night. Um, what? Yeah, I bet. She, she's like, oh, I use all these five different shoes. Oh, she does. Yeah, she does. Ashley is creeping up into Abby's size shoes. Yeah. Well, maybe Abby gets some new ones and you can get her old ones. I think I'll let it be